rusted out. We've got a slide that's missing here. Wendy Buford is talking about the playground at Minnie Klein Elementary in Savannah. And she says the list of things wrong with it and possibly unsafe is lengthy. Broken slides, uh, they're boarded up. We have broken steps. Um, we have water damage and erosion. And she's not the only one who's taken note. We have over 600 kids out here every day playing. And granted, we have a wide open space. But when you talk about our play structures and then you talk about play, you know, you really want to make sure that you have some adequate opportunities and also some safe opportunities that a parent can feel good about when their kid comes home at the end of the day. But Mini Klein principal Troy Dunn says they don't feel good about it. And they're doing something about that. Concerned PTO parents have applied for 32 grants to help fix and update the playground, parts of which are more than 40 years old. Without the grants, we're looking at about 494,000. With the grants, we're still needing about 200,000 right now. We've had some parents that put on some uh, cupcake sales and different fundraisers such as that, but when you're talking about the scope needed for out here to, to make sure 600 kids have a good place to play, it's an awful lot of money. A lot of cupcakes. It's a lot of cupcakes, that's right. <laughs> With help from Lowe's and playground designers AFCO, the school's PTO hopes to get a little closer to their goal, but it's one they say they can't reach without help from the community. A silent auction dinner and 5K run are planned to help get them a little closer to that goal. They say isn't only providing quality playtime for kids, but much safer playtime as well. We are definitely trying to make sure that our children are taken care of and they're safe when they come to school. This project is one of those things that when you think about doing what's best for kids, it just needs to be done. Alex Flippin, Fox 26, KNPN. Equipment here, and so I'm showing the old playground equipment. Well, they...